Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart, the Prince of Wales, and welcome to a shout-out and review video. I am bringing this series back, my friends. I had this series going a long time ago on my channel. The last time I did a video like this was probably about five or six months ago. Certainly at the back end of last year, but I think now would be a good chance to bring it back and do a few episodes. So today we look at a YouTuber who goes by the name of Ants Holland LP. So I'm assuming that's Ants Holland Let's Play. Now, he's been added to the Total War YouTube community, which I'll bring up right here. So this is a page for those of you that want to add your channels. Let me know in the comment section and I can add your channels here with a tiny bit link. Um, it's about oh, it's a good 20 or so people on here, I think. Um, different people are on here, like the Face Man, Stiff Swell, Lord Rexasaur, Alan Knight, Jethko, and Al Alan Ants Holland is at the bottom by here. I've also got Strategic Gaming and Kassam187, who for some reason I couldn't add their links at the top. Uh, it kept uh, spamming out or freaking out, but I put them here at the bottom as their full links. But anyway, that's uh, all the channels to check out if you want to check other people out. But today we're focusing on Ants Holland LP now. I like the name, I like the fact that it's got the uh, Dutch kind of flag in his name, it looks pretty cool. Uh, the white background it looks pretty nice as well, it goes well with the YouTube thing. Maybe you could perhaps jazz it up a little bit and have something else there perhaps. Um, because your channel is mainly Mountain Blade as you can tell from your avatar, so maybe have like a, a Mountain Blade thing going on in the background as well to, to accompany that. But otherwise, I, I'm really impressed, I like the font as well, the bits, the bits kind of... Uh, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Falling off the H and the O. Uh, looks kind of war-torn, which I really like about it. It looks quite dirty. It's one of the things I like with your uh, your title, your, your channel uh, logo. But anyway, uh, we're going to look at your channel. So on the home page right now, we're on all activities, and we can see you've liked a uh, video of Shogun 2 Total War Battle, which you've done uh, a day ago. You've got your uh, Dutch campaign for um, the uh, Mountain Blade. Is it uh, Legil or Legal? I can't pronounce French properly, I'm afraid, my, guy, uh, my friends, but uh, for, you're doing a Dutch campaign in there, so if you guys want to check that out, by all means, check him out. Also, a link to Ants Holland channel will be in the description below, so you can check him out from there as well. Uh, you liked the video by Air of Carthage, you like one of my videos, which is, which is really awesome, so an extra 10 points to you. Um, and you like a lot of other people as well, um, learning old English. Uh, we've got War Eagle, got a video you've liked from War Eagle, got another one from mine. Just going to go have a quick look, just go through like, about a week or so's videos. L liked your Scotland campaign, but there, episode 3 of that. And uh, got a few more, uh, another of my tutorials from a week ago. And yeah, it's pretty pretty cool, it's pretty nice stuff. They like quite a few of my videos, so thank you for that. It's really, really uh, appreciated by me. And yeah, you've definitely you definitely got the whole Total War thing going on with the, with the channels that you support on here, like War Eagle, uh, Warrior of Sparta, which you subscribed to a week ago as well. So very nice to see Surreal Beliefs as well. But anyway, let's look at your channel. So we're going to go on to uh, videos. We're going to check out some of your videos. So we'll go on the most recent one, which is your Shogun 2 Total War Battle. We're going to play the first uh, few seconds also. Let's get the volume on as well. Get the volume on. Okay, so my long time allies have betrayed me and they're trying to murder me and I've just created an enormous folk storm and I've basically exterminated them all with Yariyashi Garu, which I just raised in my town. Oop, I could hear your steam message then in the background. Just gonna pause it but there you your steam message come on in the background. That's uh that's fine. I do I make that mistake sometimes as well. I, I often record and forget to have uh, forget to turn steam uh, off. Uh volume could be slightly louder, but apart from that it was pretty good commentary. Um, the other thing which I noticed as well when I clicked on the video is your thumbnail. You could perhaps um, add a thumbnail there. I know some of them haven't got them, uh, like your Scotland one and your Dutch campaign do, but then perhaps jazz it up just a little bit. Um, I don't know if you use Photoshop or or anything to, to edit your videos, uh, your thumbnails. You could try and use Paint.net. That's a free one which you can get off uh, online. Um, but other than that, yeah, your commentary is pretty cool, pretty solid. Um, I'm actually going to go back onto your video and give you a like, actually, because I haven't liked that video. How, how rude of me not to like it, but your um, your channel is pretty good. You've got got lots of great content on here. You've got Shogun 2, so check that one. You've got Medieval 2, so check that one. You've got Mountain Blade, so check that. You've got quite a, quite a combination of two different game series, really. You've got Total War, and then you've got Mountain Blade, and you've got multiple things on those games. You've got a fantasy element with House Lock by here, and the uh, Clash of Kings mod, and you've also got your Dutch campaign. You've got your kind of Napoleonic era for um mountain blade and then you've got your total war stuff he's got more modern kind of total war with your um your shogun 2 online battles and your shimizu versus christian rebel stuff but then you've also got more of a historical 
Total War game, a game which is about 10 years old now in Medieval 2, which is a really popular game and still being played by many channels, including myself, which I'm doing at the moment with the Wales campaign. So it's great to see that. You've also got other stuff here. You've got Heroes and Generals, which is a game I'm not that familiar with, to be honest with you, but I may actually check your videos out. Uh, views wise you're doing pretty well on some of these older videos you've got 43 views on that one there so that was pretty cool you've got 45 by there on uh, a video saying why you have made videos that was from three weeks ago i believe i watched that video as well actually so um i know uh, why you have me making things um, but you've got lots of different things on here i think the thumbnail thing um is perhaps a definite thing you can look into um but like i said paint.net is something i would recommend um but you can get Photoshop as well you know, at, at, a, at a push. It depends on your kind of budget. I got Photoshop Elements 11 for about £65 on Amazon. That was over a year ago. But, you know, there are ways you can get things for free on the internet. Uh, nudge, nudge, wink, wink. I'm not saying anything <laughs> Not saying anything else apart from that. But, yeah, definitely, I definitely recommend that. Now, if you go into your uh, playlists, you've got different playlists on here. You've got Rohan Music. You've got your like videos, of course. You've got your Mountain Blade series with two videos, Soviet Squad. Uh, Axis Squad, Heroes and Generals Killing Sprees, Le Guil Mod French Campaign, your Viking music. Uh, you haven't got your Scotland, or oh, you have got your Scotland, have you? No, you haven't got your Scotland campaign on here, so I'll definitely uh, look into putting your Scotland campaign on there. Um, Minecraft, got Minecraft on there. I, I don't um, watch Minecraft, so I can't really comment there. <laughs> but yeah, cool. Um, let's go look onto your channel, your channels. So you've got like nice little channels pages got some great guys you've got some i'm assuming these are your friends pineapple on pc uh freddo fast garnia and rumbler rack played so they got your people you promote there and it also shows your subscriptions you've got warrior sparta serial police lionheart and many other channels as well not much to say there really uh yeah if you go, go feature channels it just shows the same thing and if you're going to your discussion just gonna go into your discussion page and you've got uh, war eagle there hey great channel you got awesome uh Let's see more of this guy, brilliant content, needs more videos. So awesome stuff there. So I'm just going to write a little message for you right now. You are current, if I can spell uh, correctly, currently being recorded for a shout out and channel review. There we go. So you'll see that message. Hopefully it's been shared on Google Plus as well. Like I said, the Google Plus group at the start of the video, these things get shared about. So it helps keep all the smaller channels and all the channels included um, as a nice kind, of, nice kind of close knit community and helps each other grow. So that's why I do all my stuff with Google Plus. I'm going to go on your about page and have a quick look at that as well. And as you can see, there's actually nothing on your about page. Ooh, you want to put something on there because um, anybody that's new who's just stumbled onto your channel, doesn't actually know what your channel does. I mean, obviously, I can tell from the the logo and the Anne Holland thing. It gives me an idea, but you, you want you want to be quite certain on what you're clicking on when you're going onto different people's channels. So, I definitely recommend having just something there. Uh, it can be your computer specs. It can be why you do YouTube. It can be what your channel's about. Anything, even if it's just a few lines, just put something there that suggests what your channel does and what you're hoping to do or achieve on your channel. Just something along those lines, just to fill it out. Because believe it or not, anything you put in your about page actually helps your video and your channels get promoted because your all the words that you use in your descriptions, whether it's a video description or an about page, counts as an SEO. Now, SEO is search engine optimization, and it means that your channel will be uh, categorized appropriately on YouTube, which means that somebody looking for Mountain Blade will find your channel much easier if you've got more stuff there than, than what you've currently got. So definitely, definitely look into your about page and also your thumbnails. So they are two things I would definitely recommend. I'm going to go back onto one of your videos. I'm going to go back onto your Shogun 2 one, actually. I'm going to pause the video right but there. I'm just going to go on to your description. And there isn't actually a description here. So again, you need to have something in a description. Just, um, I don't know, something... The links back to um well something that, that promotes your video so we can say this is the first part of or whatever this is a video that i prepared blah 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 um for more information check out whatever um, if you've got twitter or facebook put them on there definitely as well um just something along those lines you know even if it's just like a channel blurb you now a channel blurb is something which you can put on for all your videos if you go onto your um default settings on video manager you can just put something on there like um my channel blurb my name is ant holland lp i make videos on total war and mountain blade warband um if, if you like the sound of that subscribe for more content blah 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 and just say like you know i'm i'm 20 whatever or, or 19 or whatever how old you are 
Um, I'm a Welsh gamer, English gamer, something along those lines. Just be a little bit descriptive, not too descriptive, but a little bit descriptive um, as a channel blurb because that will go onto all your videos. And just so basically, um, SEO stuff and thumbnails is the main thing, really. And apart from that, I think your channel's pretty cool. You've got lots of great stuff on here. I'm just going to go down a bit more just to see if there's any more stuff we've missed out. Um, if you're just going to go through Minecraft, oh, there's the Minecraft stuff for there. Um, Rohan, Troll, you've got lots of uh, Rohan stuff on here. I'd like to see some more Rohan stuff. That would be pretty cool. Got some of your um, online battles as well, which is pretty nice uh, as well. So yeah, just 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 the thumbnails really, and a little bit of stuff in the description and the about page. And I think you'll be pretty good, and that's what you need to do. But anyway, that ends this um, this channel review slash shout out. So definitely check out Ants Holland LP if you like the sound of that, and you want to check out some Dutch campaign or some Scotland campaign on Medieval 2 Total War. I've been Dragonheart, the Prince of Wales. Thank you for watching. Until next time, goodbye. Yeah.